later. Twitch, welcome back. We are back for the final portion of tonight's show. Um, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes, we are. Travis. Yes, we are. Where, where okay. are, where are all of us? We're all split up. Where are we? Yeah. So that's a good question. Um, Fonalyn, uh, you are flying over the water and over the island, um, right. and you are heading towards uh, towards the ship. You're heading back to the elegy. Um, the rest of you guys are with the little girl. With the little girl. Oh, she fell off. Um, yeah, and you can tell, like, the night's cold. She's kind of just wearing rags. Uh, and you can feel her, like, shivering. You're kind of, like, hunched over and holding on to Swiftwind's mane and doing your best, I'm sure, to hold both of you on. Yep. <laughs> nope. Yep. Nope. Dishing her. Yeah. <laughs> Get and, off. Uh, and, Fawn, roll me a d20. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, caps lock is on. Don't need that. Ah. All right. Yeah. So you're you're just still kind of like buzzing from the battle, and uh, your feet are kind of itchy. You think they might have been burned, so that's gonna be unpleasant tomorrow. I don't like that. Yeah. But you're you're just flying on your way back. The rest of you guys, however, are swimming. <laughs> um. So you know, Asha's quite proficient at swimming, and the rest of you are all floating on stuff. Uh, so you're able to kick and paddle the 100, 200 yards, whatever I said it was, back to the uh, kind of stony shoreline. Um, you guys get there and meet up eventually. What do you do? All of us? All four? Uh, yep. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, Asha's I... like kind of coughing and hacking up... Uh, uh, some water as she drags herself on the shore. Um, you see Nina chug another vial. <laughs> you what? You see Nina chug another vial. Okay. I, I, I chug another vial. I, I, I chug another vial. Yep. So yeah, Nina, even with all that, you're feeling fucking awful. Like, yeah, I imagine this is probably the same on recommends so this is not the first time I've felt this shit. Yeah, I mean you you're like half of your face is burning, you got like a cleave into your uh I didn't into think your I chest. Got touched by the fire just yet, Travis. I thought I was just close to it. Fire? No. Acid? Yes. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. I thought you meant fire as in fire, yeah, burning. Nope. Yeah, so you're you're just feeling terrible. Um but yeah, you you guys meet up. What do you do? To the ship now. She barks at her. Please. <laughs> Nina releases her attack dog. <laughs> <laughs> right, um, I just say to the ship what now. What happened? Boys. Did you, are, they you they all, out of here. are they all dead? What happened? No. I got. I went and got my scythe back, and I got the beach. Well, <laughs> the shit kicked out of me. Let's just say. But he didn't spill his. She didn't spill her beer. <laughs> you know what's silly? This is out of character. Nina would make the worst bard ever because she doesn't ever lie about her escapades. Uh, like I defeated them all single. Yeah, I killed I, them no, all. No, no. I'm not playing a bard. With trust me. If I will um, play a bard, I'll be role playing it. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. so. We're all we're back. Yeah, we're on the I'm beach. Just, yeah, and I um. So while while Nina's getting questioned, I'm like just like wringing my clothes out and like yeah. sort of like getting set, and I'm like, they're heading to their ship, the ship we saw to the north. There, oh, okay, is that ship still there? Look over. Hey, we, I don't you think you guys we can see. can't really tell. All you see on the water is a conflagration of flames. Oh, that's true. I guess the fire yeah, is flames, and it's further around the the cove or whatever, much further. And right, I'm like, like, I, I, we'd seen it before from here. Kind of. I, I had no. I had seen it because I walked along the beach for a ways, invisible. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um... It, it's ways up, and I'm like, they're getting under their ship, and they're coming for our escape vessel. Asha looks at you. Asha looks at you, Durian, and says, "Is speed more important than discretion?" I nod. Right now. <laughs> yes, we have to go. Excellent. Uh, and she mutters a few words, and uh, some light flares on the tip of her trident, and says, "We'll make it. 
through the woods faster with this. Let's go. The way. Yeah, and right. she Let's just go. starts running. Yeah. And she looks at you, Cave, and says, "What? What direction are we going in?" Did she ask me which direction we should be, or like, is she asking like, are we going? What in? direction should we be going? Okay, in? I point towards the, sh the ship. I point coming. the opposite direction of the cove. Like, I point like, yeah, well, you know, roughly. Yeah. So I guess what she's asking you, Caben, for is to Lead. try and track back to essentially where your paddle boat is, right? Our boat wasn't it like shot to hell? But yes, I'm leading them back towards the cove where we landed. Excellent. Give me a tracking check. Okay. Do I get bonuses for, like, f flying over beforehand so I know the lay of the land and everything? Uh, you know the lay of the land from the sky? You're on the ground now. You get to walk with all the other plebeians. Well, that's how we got here in the first place. We walked through this land. Like, I, this is a familiar... I feel like this is somewhat familiar territory for me. I'm... Like, you came here at night. There's no, like, bonus for trying to retrace. All right. Well, I tried. It's not a It's um, not a super tough. Survival, right? That's tracking? Yes. 18. 18. All right. Yeah, I mean, you guys uh, take a while and, and go through the woods. Um, Asha flares up her light uh, a couple more times. But with uh, light to go by instead of just uh, moonlight... Takes you maybe forty minutes to get through the woods and and locate your rowboat. Mm -hmm. You can see what looks like the um, silhouette of the elegy. Can we all? Can we all get? In the, can we have another party member? Can we all get into the rowboat? Um. Yeah. I mean, no problem. You have as many party members as you did before. And I. Uh, and no, we have Ariane too. No, she's in the. They're, oh yes, they're she's on got... Swiftwind. That's right. It was the four of us. Yeah. Uh, the four of us, I thought... It, I mean, I get it now. Okay. Um, yep. And I'm like, we should have told Swiftwind to leave if something gets wrong. Or tell Swiftwind and the boat to leave. Um, we got a row. The, the captain the will take we, care of his ship if he needs to. But we, we got a row, get... but we don't have time. We got to go now. Right. And uh, you see her, like, reach into her pack and pull out, like some cloth, could be a cloak or something, um, and she just starts, like, stuffing it in the holes. Yeah, I, uh, I, I, I rip off parts of my cloak, or... I take off my cloak, and I help. Duran, yeah. Duran, can you still, uh, make some loud noises? You don't want to ask me right now what I can and can't do. Can you call to the boat for someone to come pick us up? Because this is too... This boat is shot to hell. This boat gonna... can't. The boat can't get closer, Cabin. Not it's the. Deep. Not the big ship, Swiftwind. I don't know if they'll hear us, and it will only. The boat, this this little rowboat is shot to hell, and we're going back over the. Cabin, yeah, last time we went off. over these waters, somebody who's not here decided that's to what I, the, the sea that's inhabitants. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. We're rowing over. What are you two arguing about? We've got the whole stuff. Let's go. Yes, oh. we'll we'll make through, or oh, we'll even. Bucket the water out. Let's just go. I'm not worried about They're the water. Ways. Guys, I'm worried about the the fucking sea creatures. That's what I'm saying. Call out. You guys had problems. They, they trashed your boat, didn't they? Well, yeah. pray to the higher powers we don't run into them. We don't have a choice. If I call out, I don't want to alert our attention to them. Between these little sea creatures and what's well, going to well, By the way, Travis, we're talking as we're, like, getting into the boat. And, like, I, I'm, like, I'm shouting back as, like, I'm <laughs> the boat. Like, I'm not. <laughs> this is not a debate, like, standing on the shoreline. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you guys uh, pile in the boat and start rowing. Um, and let me think here. So it was over there, over back. You guys got there around midnight, right? Uh, nice. uh, maybe a little later. Yeah. I think it was later. I think we left at midnight. So. Okay. Yeah. So. All right. It's probably about four a.m. Yeah. So sun's still not peeking over the horizon yet. Um, so yeah, you guys start rowing back. Um, and can I get perception checks from everyone? Loud, Not fun. loud noises. And I'll figure out my mod in a second. Um, did I actually put points into it after all? Uh, 19 total. Oops. What happened? I rolled it on Skype. 
20. Okay. Um, cool. You guys uh, just start rowing back to the ship. Um, and you... It uh, takes you a while, because it's like 400... It's like a quarter of a mile offshore. Uh, but you guys roll out and um, manage to get back to the ship. As we're, getting, um, as we're getting close, I'm calling up, and I'm like, Captain, get us on board! Get the sails going! Yeah, you see um, Fawn and another sailor, like, uh, throwing down a rope ladder. Yeah, yeah, and I'm also, I, I, even as we're approaching, I'm like, furl the sails! We have to go! We have to go! Yep, you hear the at, captain yelling the same thing. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm looking at Duane, I'm just like, wait, first, I'm, go. I'm, I'm going up first. Because that climbing the ship comes like this. Okay. Yeah, I wait. Give me a climb check. No, I'm just kidding. No, yeah, I, you guys get up there. <laughs> no, I, I'm last up. Uh, Travis, uh, before I climb up, I'm waiting for everybody else. I'm scanning the waters. I'm looking at the horizon for shadows. You know, another yeah. boat coming. Do I see anything? Uh, not right now, no. Oh, thank you. Not right now. <laughs> not Good. yet. Yeah, so so you guys climb up. Um, you don't see and, the uh, the ship gets underway and starts uh, sailing back south again. Mm -hmm. uh, Fawn goes up into the crow's nest again. Okay. okay. Yeah, Fawn, your your feet are burning and itching. It like you're pretty hurt, right? Uh, I'm. I mean, not really. I'm down to twenty nine out of. But you're you got burned, bitch. <laughs> One point of fire damage. It hurts. Yeah, one point of fire damage is not a lot. Oh, That's right, like... you only took, like, one point. Yeah. Okay. That's yeah. the fire damage, yeah. Yeah, yeah I mean, your, your left heel up. is a little itchy. Tra but... Travis, so I, I have a couple actions to make, so... Yeah, I want, sure, I'm going sure. to the crow's nest as well. Yeah. Wait, get out of here! There's room! There's another get random guy was up there. Uh, all right, all right, guys. One sec. Uh, Fawn, I need a d20 from you. God damn it. That's I fine. All right. right. Um, you, you still feel quite unwell. Um, like, now that the adrenaline has worn off, you feel, like, really drained and, and strange, like, it, you, you feel, like, itchy and warm all over, like, your clothes don't fit right, and it just, mm. you're not, you're not feeling so hot. Um, it's not, like, debilitating or anything. I am uncomfortable. I don't like it. Well, actually, you know what? Fawn, Fawn wouldn't say anything. She'd just power through it because... Yeah, that's you're, how, you're yeah. a soldier. She doesn't sure. say anything. She just kind of uh, grins and bears it. Okay. Grins. It's like, I'm itchy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm itchy. All right. Yeah, and Cave, and you climb up in the crow's nest, too? Yeah. Yep. So I have some action, Travis, when you're ready. Sure. Let's check out what Nina's doing, if anything, first. Well... After I clean up, I'm going to go visit our new guest. No, so so when we're getting on board, my action has to do with Nina, so if that matters. Oh, all right, yeah, you, like, so Nina, you're, like, getting up and taking stock of your stuff. And you she's cleaning up and getting sorted. I'm like, Nina, I can't help you anymore today. Understood. You, you need to... List. Nina, what... We're not getting out of here with another, without another fight. There's going to be a battle. It's going to happen. Maybe you, not. Today. You, the captain himself said this ship is quite fast. When, no, we want to, when we want to move. Yeah. Maybe. But just so you know, we're going to have another fight today. You need to stay back until the last possible moment. Because we need oh, okay. you to be available. We need you to be fit. Tyrion, I don't have a bow. You know this. No, I lost it in the, in the first fight. No, I'm not saying the bow. I'm saying you. even if it means that you don't fight at all, you need to wait. And try and take people from behind or wait till they get on board. But don't be a target until it's the last possible moment. I can't help you. I understand. And I'm actually going to crack a smile. I'm just going to pat him on the shoulder. I understand your concern. I can handle myself. Alright. Cool. I throw my hands in the air and I walk off to find, tap the rum barrel. <laughs> nice. Okay, yeah. Just for, just for a nip to warm up. Yeah. Not, like, just, just a, a little cold, though. Yeah. Yeah, just a nip. Yeah. So, Nina, you said you were doing what exactly? 
uh, I was cleaning myself up, and then I'm going to go see say hello to our new little guest, which I assume a certain person who I know his name, but I haven't played in two weeks, so you're gonna have to give me a second, Travis. Um, uh, what's your name? Too indirect. Asha, that's it. Asha and Arian. Yeah, I assume Asha is with Arian. Sorry, I'm heading over there. Uh, yeah, I mean, you you head into the cabins, um, <clears throat> and you uh, you don't see anyone right away. But you you know you check a couple doors and check. Uh, uh, there was like a separate crew room that was pretty small, but it's uh, something Asha was using. Um, so you like knock on the door and hear, "Who is it?" It's me. Uh, she cracks the door open and says, "What? What? Are they following us?" Uh, I just came to see if everything's okay. We're fine, thank you. I I appreciate all of your help. You look terrible, by the way. Let me here. Let me do something about that. Um, and she starts murmuring some words. Um, and whoa, nice. Uh, she heals you for 24. Holy what the fuck? <laughs> she, All right, she well then. That's... Oh, I'm buff again. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. Very interesting. Change of plans. I... Nina, you're on the front line again. <laughs> yeah, uh, I didn't realize. Okay. Um, I. Right. That's all I can help you with today, but I you hope it's enough. What did you say? Sorry. I said, how is she holding up? We need to get her back to, uh, back to Ripian. She's fine. It's just been an ordeal. If it's possible, I'd like to ask her a few questions. Absolutely okay. not. I, I perk. It's pretty important. I had a strange feeling about one of her captors. What does that mean? Well, you, and I paused for a second. It was the guy with the crossbow, right? I had a weird... What do you remember? You told me that apparently my blood was boiling or something, Travis. Which is what weird because I'm not a ranger and I don't get preferred enemies. Which is the like, reason why they blood boils. But, um, You're thinking too mechanic-wise. Uh, so you said, obviously... You said my blood was boiling, and I was pretty much in the process of dying, Travis, so give me a little bit of leeway here. <laughs> Events went fast. He's not going to reiterate. I, I, will, I, will, I will say, Travis, and... Gotta Josh, write these things down. No, no, no. I will say in Josh's favor, it was unclear about the specific referent of, what, of who you were referring to. I remember what you said. I won't say it now, but I don't remember who you said it about, if you will, if you can clarify that. I said you saw a creature with a uh, furry, uh, yellowish orange. Yeah, face. yeah, yeah. Okay, that's that's all I heard. Yeah. Okay, well, never mind. I just. It's not yeah, my she fault. She looks at you strangely. I, look, she needs rest. This isn't the time. All right. Oh. I'll let you. I'll let you know if something happens. Please do. I go. Okay, cool. So you guys are just chilling on the ship, on the lookout. Yeah, I. Uh, I mean, and Nina went down first, but I'm gonna go talk to Asha. Okay. And, and the captain, if I could. Uh, we don't need. Captain's to... up on the wheel. Yeah, yeah. I'm Asha first. Okay. But, yeah. And, you... But I'm. I, I take my time, so it's maybe after Nina goes down. Sure. Do you want to talk to the captain in the meantime? Yeah, yeah. So I got the captain. I say. Yeah. Captain, how fast can the ship move? Fast, but I don't know how fast their ship is. Do you think they were coming back around uh, on Cap the east side of the mo uh, the island? Cap, yeah. If they guess, it's a 50-50. They could go east or west. They're, I think they're going to come for us, whether it's now or in 24 hours. I think we need to gear for battle, and so you need to make all possible speed. They have they have some 
powerful and dangerous people with them. Uh, lizard folk, uh, people who spoke draconic, if you know of it. Uh, okay, I, we're tacking into the wind at this point. We're moving as quickly as we can. I mean, the That's, wind's the same for them. So. Yes, exactly. I'm, I'm fine with that, but I steal your men. There's going to be a battle before we get back home. Well, my men are sailors, not soldiers. Yes, but steal them to not lie awake at night. Know that if they know something's coming, at least that they are ready to prepare for it. He nods. Okay, and then I and I go down to see Asha. Okay, yeah, you knock on the door. Uh, she answers it, kind of opens it up a crack. Oh, Durian, uh, how can I help you? We have a word, and I gesture out to the hallway. Of course, and she uh, pops out and closes the door. What about? How's the captor? The captive. Well, she's not a captive anymore. Let's hope it stays that way. Ariana's fine. She's tough for a girl her age. I will do my best. Um, you have to know that this isn't over yet. I imagine not. I look at her I look her right in the eyes for a moment, like a long beat, and I say I think we both need to rest and we need to try and rest because otherwise we're not much of use. She just nods and says, You're right, I'll try and get some sleep. I don't think they'll catch up to us immediately, but Hopefully the captain will put him off long enough that we can be of use again. She nods and says, was there anything else? Good work out there. We did it. We came out. I told you. I told you. All of us she, made it out. She gives you a kind of a... She nods and gives you kind of a long look. Um, and she just hugs you. She gives you a big hug and says, I don't know what we would have done without you. I'm sorry, I should have been more forward at first. Um, I, I just accept the hug and say, I understand. I understand. But in my brain, all I'm doing is feeling her breasts against my chest. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, and then, Travis, I, I immediately go and I'm, I'm going to try and get eight hours of sleep. I'm going to go and try and get some rest. Okay, cool. So you guys uh, bunker down. Um, Fawn, Caven, you guys are up in the crow's nest. Uh, Caven, you hear... <clears throat> um, and Fawn, you hear... What's going on? No one tells me anything. <laughs> Caven, I know you're up there. But I need to fly up and clop you on the head. Fawn quickly takes off the ring and gives it to Caven. And says, she doesn't I think answer like him. to talk to you. <laughs> the cave, she doesn't answer him. She's like, here, it's yours. The phone, the phone <laughs> all for you. Uh, I give her a glare, take the ring, I and start, speak to him in Elvish start and walking say, down. Your friend would like to speak to you. Start walking down. <laughs> okay. And on the way down, it's like, you know, it's your ring. And I start keep on going. I just ignore him. Yeah, I get down to the bottom, and uh, I tell Swiftwind the story of how we... Everything that happened from he loving us off... Are made. On the, yes, I explain that, too. Yeah. But first, I explain... Cool. Yeah. You and, fill him in. Yeah, I fill him in. And I like say, you, you saved the captive. You got them out here safe. Yes, was that little filly... Uh, oh, get, was she our goal the whole time? Apparently, I'm still very confused as to what we just did. Apparently so. Uh, we we thought we were just going to kill some bad people. Apparently we were, we were, the whole goal was to rescue her. Well. So we did it. Hey. Uh, should we be worried? Are they, going, are they going to be reprisals? They're probably on our tail. Damn it, I thought he was I back. Okay. <laughs> uh, 
Um, so we're we're waiting to see if they'll catch up to us or not. Um, I don't know if you can. I don't know if you can see further past the horizon if you flap around, but I don't. We don't. We don't know when they're coming at us, but we we're, we think they're after us. He kind of shakes his head and says, "I can see well in the dark, but only for a short distance." Uh, would perhaps your eyes would be better? Would you care to take a look? He kind of jerks his head up. Sure. Actually, yeah, I was trying to get a good vantage point for the crow's nest, but we can go higher than that. Yes, we can. <laughs> yeah, sure. Um, I shout out to, I guess, Fawn. I'm going to go take a look on the horizon and do the thing. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, so you guys uh, start flying up. Um... And give me a perception check. Why did that go? Thirty-one. Okay. Thirty-one. Holy <laughs> shit! Yeah. So you guys um, fly up, um, and you know it's it's kind of tough to see stuff in the moonlight, um, but you do see what looks like. Uh, a very small spot of light on the water, um, mm. orange light rather than you know, kind of the the sort of whitish blue coming off the moons. It looks like it could be a torch on a ship. Yeah. Um, can I estimate distance? Or was that too much? Ah, uh, few miles back, but it seems to be heading in the same direction that you are. Yeah. Fuck, I'm not going to get it hours. God damn it. Um, hmm. How fast can you fl how fast can you cover a mile, Swiftwind? Uh, a mile? Oh, shoot. Um You see that? Oh, he can't even see the torch, can he? Damn it. <laughs> I can't explain to him how long a mile is. <laughs> no. No, he certainly cannot. <laughs> uh, uh understand. What do you see down there? I think I see the ship. It's looks like it's coming towards the same direction. And I... Uh... Swiftwind, what, how fast can you, like, fly between... the distance between, like, human towns? Uh, I, I'm not sure. What, which towns? I mean... I don't even know what they're called. Hmm... I guess they're just trying to find out a way to see how fast it can fly. Uh, it's very yeah, I mean, that. You, you've seen him flying. You know he's 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 pretty swift. The name isn't for nothing. Right. I mean, I, I mean, I I imagine like within a short distance I can see him go far, but I don't know how fast he can cover three miles or a mile. I guess. Okay. Well, I'll I'll, I'll go back down. We'll go okay. back down to the boat. And um. I'll wait around at the base. I don't know. Talk with Swiftwind, catching up on anything else, and waiting for Durian if he pops back out. Okay. Or when he pops back out, I think he's coming out. Yeah. Cool. So the yeah, Durian, you probably you were resting, weren't you? Yeah, I'm trying to get eight hours. I thought okay. you were gonna come talk to the captain. You? No, I did already. Oh, okay. I did. I did right when I got on the ship. I talked to him. I said that we've got pursuit. Yeah, yeah, yeah um, you're right. And I wouldn't know that anyways, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so you, you head back to the ship, and you and Fawn, you know, you guys need less sleep than humans or half-elves anyway. Yeah. So. Just trancing up here. Okay, you know. cool. Everything is awesome. Yeah, so uh, the, the sun starts to come up over the horizon, um, and the captain uh, calls out to you, Caban, and says, Caban, come up here. Yeah. I go up. Can we see the ship now with the sun up? Yeah, that's he calls you up there and oh, points okay. back and says, uh, unfurls a, a telescoping lens and looks and says, "Have a look." <laughs> I'll have a look. What yeah, do I you see? you look out and you can see uh, a ship on the horizon. Damn it! A few miles maybe behind you, but it's light visible now, isn't it? Okay. Shit. Yep. Okay. Um, 
How long do we have? Uh, it depends on their speed, but they don't look to be gaining on us quickly, if at all. We might be able to lose them, but we might not. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I was thinking about doing something, but I think it's too, it's light enough where they would notice someone flying towards them. Um, okay, well, I, I give this spyglass back to him and say, I think our rest of our party is trying to get some kind of rest, but if, if, they get, if they get closer, if it seems like they're gaining us more, come get us. Um, I guess keep tabs on their on their progress. Maybe we can't run them. Maybe we can just stay ahead of them this whole time. But at best, it's going to be hours before they would catch us. Yeah. Get some rest. Okay. Cool. Go up. Tell um, Fawn the same thing. Okay. You shout it up at me. I come up. Okay. Oh yeah, I guess you are on a Pegasus. So you could easily just fly up and talk to me, and then. I had gotten off. I'm just cl I'm just climbing up. Okay, well, I'm just hanging out, nursing my wound quietly, uh, trancing. Uh, you can't, like, trance in the crow's nest. Because it's, like, rocking back and forth. The whole boat is! <laughs> True, but, like, the higher up you are, the more severe it is. Like, that's why you want to have a cabin in the middle of the ship as low as you can get. Okay, mm. then I'd climb down and go trance somewhere below deck, even though I'd probably be nauseous and miserable. Okay. And let me I don't know, man. Um, when it's like when you can't see, sometimes it makes it worse. But other times, when you can see, it's it's mm. it's worse. So I don't know. Car sickness. Yeah. Don't know, man. All right. Well, wherever she is, I fill her in, and I guess we're all catching up what sleep we can, or what rest we can in the meantime. Okay. Let me find something real quick. Okay. He's trying to do like linear algebra to figure out <laughs> how long, how long a, a ship catches up to another ship. I imagine some rolls may be necessary. Okay, cool. So you guys go in to, uh, to rest. And I am going to send one of you a private message. Oh, shoot. You should just send us. Make sure you actually send it as a private message. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you guys um, just start prepping and, and getting uh, set up to rest for the night. Um, Durian, you and uh, Nina are probably probably waking up at this point. Hey, Nina? Nina? Or Asha? Uh, Nina, you were resting too, weren't you? I guess. I, mean, I didn't actually say I was, but I assume mm. if... You know, I Nina assume that at some point I would be resting, so... Especially okay. if we've had eight hours. Uh, I I, I'm, tr I'm going for eight hours, so I don't wake up until I've slept eight hours. Travis, so do I wake up? Okay. Excellent. Well, um, yeah, I mean, eventually you guys do get up. Okay. I'm up. My refresh on spells? Do I, I, I consult my memory and my, my stamina, and I'm like... <laughs> do I have memory? Uh. <clears throat> Cool. Yeah. So, so you, uh, you are like, you're like good to go. Good. Yeah. So uh, as you all are kind of uh, waking up, you you hear uh, a bit of a a shout. Uh, a bit from, of a shout. Huh. A bit of a shout or a shout. A, a bit of a shout, just like what? What the fuck is going on right now? And that's okay. and that's what you hear very loudly. The whole ship I, can hear it. Ooh. I run. Uh, I, I pop awake. Travis, I made eight hours, right? Um, 
Yeah, no, this is uh, before that. Jesus Christ, then I say sleep. No, I'm <laughs> Uh, well, I mean, if you're asleep, you might not hear this. Yeah, so. you, you have to roll for me, because I, I went to sleep. Sure. I went to sleep. Um, no, you, you actually don't wake up. Good. I'm asleep. Okay. Better for uh, you all, anyway. Don't worry about it. Yeah, Nina, I were you wish. asleep as well? I, I guess, but I assume I'm near the women's quarters of the ship, being a female. Well, I mean, there isn't, quarters. like, women's quarters. It's bad luck yeah. for if I'm going to be on a ship. Uh, yeah, Nina, there's you actually really don't wake up either. Oh, um, so, Caben, you may be, like, just about to go to bed, and you hear, what the fuck? Yeah, I run to where I heard it. And okay. What? So, you, uh, you find Fawn, and her voice seems a little bit different, a little bit deeper than before. <laughs> no. <laughs> and, uh, you see that Fawn is no longer... Fauna Lynn, uh, Fawn is, I, is, is a Fauna guy. Fauna Lad? Fauna Lad? <laughs> it's a Fauna dude? is a guy. <laughs> you just, uh, Yeah, so you, you, sexy. like, you, like, so, here, I'll paint this picture. It's visibly Fawn, though? Or it looks uh, like a totally so, different so guy? So, I'll, I'll paint this picture. You, <laughs> you hear, what the fuck? And, uh, you, like, run over, you burst into, uh, Fawn's door. Um, where her and, and uh, uh, where, where she was staying, and um, you look and you see, like, Fawn, long red hair, elven features. Fawn, what, what do you look like right now? Um, I would say I essentially look the same. Um, I took my armor off to, to get some, some, some trance going on, and now I'm essentially a guy in drag um still long flowing beautiful locks and uh half naked going i don't know what's going on uh trying to figure out what the fuck happened uh i'm a guy now so caven what's your reaction on seeing this <laughs> like it's quite obviously fawn in front of you yeah so with, uh, you know, maybe a few less bits and maybe a few more. Right. Um. Came in, I don't know what happened. <laughs> it's a penis. It's a good thing. <laughs> oh, that's, that's, Welcome uh, to the club. Uh, you, uh, <laughs> you, what? <laughs> I, are there mirrors on here? You're Travis? fun? Is no. Like a mirror? no <laughs> You're still fun? I think. I'm just like looking at myself like really confused. Like I don't know what to think anymore. Uh... Are you really a wood elf? What are you? Fawn? I think. I don't know. If Fawn just keeps like looking like 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 touching herself like I don't What's going on? <laughs> I'm just like really confused. Like, Jimmy, your I don't cam's know. dead. Um, I know. I, don't I, know what to I do. was okay. geeking out. I had to turn it off. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna. I guess I'm just gonna walk around her and be like, "What? Has this happened before?" <laughs> no. Yeah. yeah. So fun. Are you like normal? covering yourself? Are you like look no, at all I'm just of this? Like, look. <laughs> she just what is this? Yeah. So yeah, fun's just like. Dropped her, her clothes off, and not her, not her. You see the expected. Wait, you dropped, uh, you dropped you, your you clothes. You see the expected physique of a, uh, you know, an average on, man, an average elven man. You dropped yeah. your okay. Uh, not um, all of them. Like, I'd keep like I don't know my my trousers, what uh, boxers? I don't know briefs. What are you wearing sure, now in the medieval under, times? The I don't even know. You see the physique of a uh, uh, a fit elven man uh, approaching middle age. I don't. Okay, I don't know. The, these are Caven's <laughs> eyes. He's like. Caven, look with your <laughs> elven <laughs> eyes. <laughs> so you look at him. He just like, like what? <laughs> this has not happened before. You don't know what's going on. Of course I don't, Caven. What are you 
Well, I don't know. I don't know if it's something you keep secret. Yeah, stuff Juan you is guys... like pointing, like pointing downwards, and it's like, do you think this is normal? It's I not. don't know. <laughs> not for me. <laughs> it's not oh, normal. Travis, what did you do? To uh, okay. <laughs> Just, okay, stay here. Just stay here. Uh, we'll be right, I'll be right back. Came and fix it. Okay, yeah, I'm going Swear. to go fix it yeah. right now. Swear. Just stay yeah. here. And he goes out and closes the door and tries to go get Durian. No! <laughs> I, I just, I love Kevin's reaction. Stay here. I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah, Durian! Yeah, so, so Durian, someone starts shaking. Well, I, no, I don't shake him. I go into the room. Is he, is, he's passed out? Yeah, he's like asleep. Okay. I go to the room where Asha is. Uh, you knock lightly on the door and don't hear an answer. No answer. Okay. <sighs> Invisibility? I know they're magic Penis users. problem. Invisibility? Um, Penis problem. This is what we're dealing with right now. He doesn't care about his... He just knows... He, he doesn't know how magic works. He just knows you guys need sleep for something. Mm -hmm. Um, shoot. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, sorry. Con concentrate on the game. Sorry. Yeah. Um. God. Okay. He's gonna go back back to Fawn's room. <laughs> okay. It's like, uh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know either. <laughs> what do Is... we do? What do I do? Um. Well. I don't know. <laughs> no, I'm just like really confused. Like I don't know. <laughs> uh, we'll we'll talk to talk to some pe the magic users. Do you want to wake okay. them? Want me wake them up? I think they need sleep. I can wake them up. I'm I'm gonna go wake up Jerry. <laughs> so like Fawn doesn't even bother to put his. Oh wait 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 wait. Clothing on. Let me. You put stay. His. I'll wake him up. Can no, he... no, Are this you... is important right now. <laughs> He's gonna flip if he sees no, it you. Is... No, it is He's not. He's gonna stab <laughs> you. <laughs> it's evil! Get it away! <laughs> Travis, what have you done? <laughs> okay, fine. I, I go I go with her, I guess. And I. Okay. But I go. I just. I'll go in the same. Go in Durian's room and I'll wake him up. I'm like, fine, just stand yeah. over there. Stand over it's, there. Yeah, like, Durian and uh, Nina are in cots, like. A couple cots apart, but yeah, you do you just like. Now we're cuddling. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not cuddling. Nina, yeah, Nina's I, not I, that dead. I'm gently waking. <laughs> not dead. Gently waking Dar Darian. Darian, we need you. Darian. Darian, wake up. Mm. Oh, fucking piss on it! What? Darian, Darian. Are they attacking? Shh, no, no. What the fuck? No, we need you. Shut, I throw it, throw it, like, at we this point, you. I pick up a pillow, I throw it, and do it, what? shut off. No, Durin. Wait, wait, wait. Shut, shut up, and I think. We're good, Durin, just wake I up. I don't know my spells, do I? Nope. I'm like, fuck, Kaven, yeah. what is it? Durin, I wasn't going to make you up, but it was going to happen anyways. Okay? What is? We, we've had a... A, a mishap? Something happened to Fawn. Oh, um, what the fuck did she do? Sound with a dwarf? She, no. Uh, <laughs> well, it's not. Mm, Fawn's not a she anymore. The fuck. <laughs> I'm going back to bed, Caven. And I turn over. She's gonna come wake you up. <laughs> She's gonna come wake you up. Uh, you know what? Let he's let... gonna come wake you up. <laughs> Okay. What the fuck are you talking about? Kaden, do you realize we're gonna die soon in a day? Come on, we're talking about trying I'm, to get I'm the looking where he's pointing. Is is Fawn is, is Fawner in the in, <laughs> in, in the room. room. <laughs> the, yeah, the, she's he Fawn is not in the same room. Okay. Oh, I thought she came I thought Fawn came with me. Uh what was I thought you did? Explicitly we'll say I told didn't, to Fawn to stay in there. I did, but she said no. I'm gonna wake him up. Okay, we'll I, I okay, I'm like, okay, Kaven. I'm not there. Kaven, I didn't point. Kaven, 
Yes. Stop pointing at nothing <laughs> and tell me if it's really important, please. It's got to be really important. It is, but I don't think you can do anything about it, so you should go to sleep. But she was going to wake you up anyways. Julian, what the fuck is going on? I can't sleep with this noise. Up, you know, rest. I get Shut up. Shut up! I get throw up. it on a pillow. Yeah, yeah, and uh, and I go. You're, over, you're out of pillows. You grab one from the cup. <laughs> uh, I I stab her through the heart, and then I go and no, I I am, Caven. This better be important. I mean, I swear, look, this is I, this could ruin us. Yeah, I start you just... I start leading him out. Look, I wasn't I I wasn't gonna wake you up. She was going to. So you're gonna woke up anyways. I'm sorry. I know the magic stuff. Actually, no, I don't know what the magic stuff is. But I just know you need sleep. Yeah. And I bring Duran to Fawn's room. Okay. Fa Fawn, how are you, like, what What are you doing right now? As soon as Duran walks into the room, like, I'm still in my skivvies, and I just point down, like, what is going on? So I don't see the I, I I don't notice the skivvies, but I see her phys physique at first, and I'm like... Yeah, Fawn's missing her breasts. She had pretty nice ones before. And, like, and now they're gone. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Wait, how are we in a four-hour call? I know, right? No, no, Travis and I never left the call. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, we didn't. Damn it, you guys. guys. Suck. You guys suck. Um, okay, so I say, I'm like, I look at her and I'm like, Fawn, you've been working out? Not that much. I don't know what to do. I look at her and I'm like, Fawn, <laughs> show me the goods. You woke, you know what, out of character. You woke Durian up. What do you think you would do? Fawn is just standing there, like, mouth agape, like, I, what? What? Take the something undergarment happened. off. So, something happened. <laughs> this is like a weird locker room. Fawn just like, <laughs> Fawn is just like, all right, that's fine. I mean, I'm not a girl for now, I guess. I don't know. And, and, yep. No more skivvies. Uh, it's Travis. It's oh. it's a it's male parts, right? Juan drops trow. <laughs> you you see a fit um, elven man approaching middle age. And I and I look at that and I'm like, oh, Juan, what did you do? Everything was fine. I promise you. What did you do? I, hold on. Oh. Oh, there we go. N Nis says that I I should attempt a male voice, but I'm like, is it my voice deep enough? Um, Durian, any bit of character. <laughs> Durian. All right. <laughs> anything you know about this? Uh, Travis, I, I'm gonna consult Knowledge Arcana. Yeah. Now, yeah, now that I see her. I see her her entire biological sex has changed, I'm gonna. Yeah, her the gender is switch sides. Different team. Well, I guys, could, guys, could I don't still know what be the same guys. team, I guess. But <laughs> yeah, uh, I. Uh, okay. <laughs> anyway, roll me an Arcana check. Arcana is good. Yes. Okay. Thirteen. You don't know what the fuck's going on. <laughs> I, I I actually like make a point of like looking and like stroking my chin and like rub, and I like. I'm not getting towards her, but I kind of like lean in a minute. I'm like, Fawn is fucked up. It's fucked up. You don't think I noticed that? Look, is this real? <laughs> Can you detect magic? Is this just a weird thing happening, or is this a spell? Did you? Oh. I look at Cave and I say, it'd be a lot easier if I had slept. This is the first time a dick has gotten me up in the middle of the night. In my life! <laughs> Literally. <laughs> I look at Fawn, and I'm like, just hold still a moment. And I put out my palm, and I uh, concentrate, and I'm going to cast Detect Magic on her. Okay. You cast Detect Magic. And you see um, some magical armor lying on the floor. A uh, magical sword, a magical rod. Um, <laughs> look back, Caben's got some. Yeah, not, not that rod. Okay, okay. Not that rod. Clarifying. Magical rod of yeah. ice. Travis got it. Or uh, Josh got it too. A magical uh, rod of ice. I mean, is it a cold penis? <laughs> uh, guys, refresh your webcams one more time. I think we're good. Just, 
Uh, I did it like four times. Is mine fine, or do I actually have to go to I'm missing Travis and Josh. Yeah, Travis and Josh for me too. I, I see everyone else. Keep going, keep going. Uh, yeah, uh, Fawn's body looks normal. No magical ores. <sighs> I'm like holding my hand out and I'm like sort of like looking with a squinty eye and I'm like, Fawn, I've got good news. Fawn? Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, yes. I'm glad we've never slept together and uh, welcome to the club. It seems that you're a man now. And I turn to go. But I don't want to be part of this club. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> try to get just try, try putting it in, you know, putting it in things. It's fine. Uh, I knew this is what this it was involved I, I mean, <laughs> but Travis, this is why I was like, "What the fuck?" To begin with, um, no, honestly, I'm, I'm like, I like, dude, fun, I don't, like, I don't, I'm not liking this. <laughs> you didn't turn into a California guy. Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't matter, dude, bro. I'm dude. role playing in some <laughs> sense. Of the word. Like, fun, dude. Fun. Yeah. Honestly, do you remember anything that would have happened to you that? was unusual. Did you feel something at some point? Did you feel... I got fucking set on fire yesterday. Does fire do that? No. <laughs> KB, you better stay away. You know what'll happen when you get set on fire. You'll die. <laughs> Nothing will happen. Fire doesn't do that. Oh. Oh my god, I know. Josh. Josh. I, know. Josh. I'm, I'm, I actually I can't say anything. doesn't say anything. I like that he knows. I like that there's an explanation. We'll go on. I say, um, Fawn. What? <laughs> what? What? What's up? I, um, retrace your steps from when you rejoined with us. Because nothing happened after you were with us. You mean like before or after Swiftwind? I retreat left the boat. Since no, since you landed with Swiftwind and met up with us. Landed on the boat. Yeah, yeah on the boat. Talked to you. Before. Went up in the crow's nest. Go back. Oh Hang god, I went there. Go backwards. <laughs> Go backwards. I was on the big fucking boat with all y'all We and fire were the whole time. I, I didn't... Uh, no, 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 fine. It's okay. But you want... Who's that little girl? I bet it was her. No, no. She chill out. Bro, bro, chill out. Bro, were, it were was the little on, girl. It was the little girl. You were on... You were on Swiftwind the whole time. Swiftwind didn't land anywhere, right? But that little fucking girl was on Swiftwind. Fawn? Fawn? Did Swiftwind land anywhere? I mean... He Between let us off the, on the boat. Between one boat and the other, no? Travis out of character, did he? No. No. Okay, Fawn. Stay focused. You know what? We, 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 just flex. Fawn is, like, still, by the way, like, without any clothing on. It's just like, bro, bro. <laughs> like, Dude, Fawn, just try flexing a little bit. It helps. <laughs> Fawn flexes a little bit and is like, yeah, that, that muscle is building faster. <laughs> Yeah, Fawn. <laughs> Testosterone everywhere. Easy. Arianne. Arianne, did she... What did she do when you were on the flight with Swiftwind? I don't fucking know. Maybe she did some... some no, 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 no. Stuff don't, I don't know. What did you notice? Anything? Or was it normal? No. You would, you're smart. You're a middle-aged <laughs> man-woman elf. You know spell casting when you see it. Did she cast anything? You've been around for a couple hundred years, yo. I didn't. I didn't notice it. I don't. I. I, I Good. That's fine. You're smart. You're smart. I. I. There was. I got. I got set on fire. My feet hurt from from the fire. It's, feet hurt. I mean. Your feet hurt. I took off my armor and rest, and mm -hmm. now your feet hurt. Your feet hurt, right? What does that have to do with anything? How long did they hurt? The time that they were in the fire. Did they burn for a long time? No. 
six seconds, give or take. I thought you said fire couldn't do this. Is Kevin like checking himself? I mean, like, they still kind of hurt. The bits there? Well, he didn't get the other bits. Oh, not there. Like they still hurt. Right <laughs> He's just really worried that like, whatever happened to Fawn's gonna happen to him. Since Fawn's only giving me the information she's given me, I'm like, I, I like rub my head and I'm like, Fawn, Fawner. Uh, we need to think of a different name for me because. Hey, Butch. No. Fawn. Um. <clears throat> Fawn sounds you're, more you're, feminine. You're, you're still Fawn. But but what if the crew asks questions? They won't know anything. They won't notice anything. Don't worry about it. You weren't notable. They won't notice I have a dick. <laughs> we'll put some clothes on and they won't. <laughs> just just a little padding and tuck. That's all I say. Padding and tuck. Padding and tuck. <laughs> oh my god. You're in armor half the time. Or all the time. Fawn. 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 We we can get this <laughs> Chat says buck. I think I think we've lost Allison, but Fawn, listen. What? <laughs> All this is is that you're possibly stronger, and we have an enemy on our tail. Let's deal with this afterwards, yeah? Because none of your answers have been coherent. I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened either. First of all, I, first of all I know what happened. You let a dude come into your room, a dude's room, and say, take your clothes off, and you complied. Put some clothes on. Fuck you, I do what I want. That's good. That's good. The star. You're a frat, bro? Oh, <laughs> Fun. All right. So, so, so you guys bicker on a little more, but uh, how does the night end? What what do you guys do? You I'm, just go back to bed? I'm not hitting on Fawn anymore. <laughs> the same sure. thing I do told I... you in the Skype chat, <laughs> All right. Well, we'll we'll leave that to the audience imagination. But yeah, you guys, uh, you know, share your surprise and marveling at what has happened, and go back to sleep. And I think that's where we'll end it for tonight. <laughs> uh, Travis, I want to watch you ask one question before we end it. Do I get any kind of explanation why I got woken the fuck up and went back to sleep? Like, like you're, Durian you're, just comes back to goes back to sleep. <laughs> Doesn't say anything. I don't know, Durian. Do you say anything? Like Nina's yeah. fast asleep over there. No, I, I, no, I don't say anything. Okay, so you guys go to bed, and that'll be it for tonight. Uh, thanks everyone for joining <laughs> us. Appreciate it, Travis. Um, well done, man. I, I know we had a bunch of trouble. Well done. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, guys. I know nothing. I know nothing. Yeah, guys. Sorry. <laughs> I. Yeah, yeah, bro. Sorry. <laughs> I apologize for the shorter session no tonight, bros. but I'm glad we could play some and find out what the hell happened. <laughs> that was... Uh, and, uh, and that's where we'll pick up next week. <laughs> hey, Travis's cam came back on. So, guys, thanks so <laughs> much for watching. Um, um, Just like he's a dude <laughs> we good? Are we good for She's next a... week? Yeah, yeah. 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 Jimmy, hold on yourself. Yeah. I'm good, yes. Okay. Jimmy? Hey, guys. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Join us next week. Hopefully, we can play for the whole session, barring any internet issues. And um, yeah, if you like the show, please give the channel a follow. Um, we're building a small audience and community, and we'd like to play D and D with you guys on Monday nights. So please when check Comcast us out so. when Comcast lets us. So yeah. Um, anyways, it's a great session tonight, and see you guys next week. Oh yeah.